Olympics. Quite often they say that you watch Olympic events, you're inspired to have a go. I find tra <laughs> trampolining well, I mean, a little bit challenging would, now. Yeah. I do. Yeah. Not getting me near a well, It's very different to <laughs> having a go on a friend's trampoline <laughs> in the garden. Wouldn't be a good idea. You've been trampolining, might you? Yeah, have, and when you, you get started, you go in a harness, because I've been down to the, the trampoline yes. centre in Buckinghamshire, and you have to start in a harness, so mm. you get more and more height mm. and do your first flip, but safely. You do it safely with a, with a, with a harness. First. Yeah. <laughs> what have you got for us now? We're going to well, talk about well, fats. I, we're talking about diver Tom Daly and well, knitting, aren't we? In uh -huh. Which is a lovely story. Yeah, yeah. Like those, those images when he was being well, watching this is the to calm the nerves, isn't it? people's creativity around the country. So Tom Daly's been knitting in Paris, but that's kind of one of his meditative things that he Calms does. Calms him down, right? During it's the his thing. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, on Wednesday, he revealed that he's been making a sweater. <laughs> and I think we can have a look at it. Uh, it's a very nice one. Have we got a picture of it? No, it's not there. Um, but... Impressive as it was, not perhaps quite as impressive as knitting a whole village of Olympic athletes, which is what a group of neighbours wow. from Surrey have been doing since December. So, Oliver Whitfield Mircic has been to see the final result. It's the Olympic Games like you've never seen before. From synchronised swimmers with pegs as nose clips to gymnasts, boxers and a Paralympian, everything is made of wool. Behind it all is nine knitting neighbours from Surrey who have spun these sporting scenes out of yarn as athletes from around the world compete in Paris. Some of the Olympic figures we looked at might be a bit hard for us to do, so then we thought of a different shape that was easier for us to um, deliver and jelly babies came out. You know, everybody started thinking of new ideas. Shall we have a cyclist? How do we knit a bicycle? And it, it just, you know, came to what we see now. From long jumps to lengthy knits, the needles have been clacking since December to get everything ready in time for the start of the Games. While teenage skateboard sensation Sky Brown is preparing for competition in France, back across the channel, her green jelly baby equivalent is right at home on the grass. And there's another Olympian who would fit in just fine here. Tom Daly, our champion diver, he loves a little bit of knitting. Yeah. Would he be welcome to come down here and join you ladies? Oh, I'm sure, oh, I'm sure Christ, we'd yes. love to see him, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> I can't knit like he does, but I'd no. love to see him. Trampoline world champion and Team GB medalist Bryony Page is certainly a fan, telling the BBC, this is just fantastic. I absolutely love it. Thank you to everyone for making the effort and for your incredible support. Amazing. <laughs> And I'm so sorry we haven't got a trampolinist and I think actually I might have to go back indoors and try and knit one. I don't know how we knit a trampoline, but I'm sure we can think something. So watch this space. There may very well be another one very soon. <laughs> if knitting were an Olympic sport, then this crafty community would certainly be contenders for gold medals. The masterpiece will be on display until the closing ceremony on the 11th of August, when it will be auctioned off in aid of the Kent Surrey Sussex Air Ambulance Charity. So cute. Absolutely gorgeous. Uh, Sarah, do you knit? Do you trampoline? <laughs> uh, lots of questions, Ooh. actually. Do you knit and do you trampoline you at the same time? any of those, Sarah. Do you know, I, I have recently started knitting, actually. I've got a bit of the Tom Daly. It's quite meditative. It's quite relaxing. I've only, only managed a scarf so far, though. And trampolining? So. Um, have been known to dabble in the garden, perhaps. How about the weather? 